Hey guys, quick update on the Prius battery. Uh, the black Prius came back with another red triangle. Again, it would last maybe a couple months and I would get this every time the battery would be hot. If you haven't seen my previous videos, I'll link them up here. But I've been fighting this one for quite some time now. Modules test good when you test them, uh, all within spec. And it just keeps giving me the generic uh, battery, hybrid battery problem code, the P080A or P8, yeah, whatever it is. You know what I'm talking about, the real generic one. So I, I'd like, okay, I gotta figure this out. So I actually pull the battery out of the vehicle and I get it up on my makeshift bench that I do all my battery work on for the three, is it three? Uh, yeah, three Priuses I own now. And I start taking the battery apart and bam, there it is right in front of me. The temperature uh, sensor, the thermistor, I guess it's technically called, on the very front, which would be the last battery away from the computer, was broken. The wire to it was broken. So I grabbed it, tried to peel it off from underneath the battery, you know where they clip on underneath the battery, tried to peel it off and the other wire broke off. There's two wires on this thing. The other wire broke off. So it was not getting a good reading from that sensor. So I went to go look for a battery, car battery harness with all the temperature sensors on it. I couldn't find the part number. Hopefully one of you guys know it out there. Leave me the part number in the description. I have a bunch of Gen 2 Priuses that I work on. I would love that lower battery harness, not the upper one with the bus bars in it, the lower one with the temperature sensors. I can't seem to find that one right. Um, anyway, let me know if you know what that is. So I went searching on Prius Chat and I found this post where it says use this Adafruit thermistor uh, some guy had done this before says this is working great so i tried it i put it in it's been about three weeks i'm still running good a real test will be if i make it past three months if i don't i'll make an update video but here's the link below in the description of the thermistor i used a couple pictures i'll throw into the uh into this as well but knock on wood i think i finally got it so update coming if i don't but I believe that's it. Anyway, that's all we have for today. Just a quick one today, let you know. I mean, I haven't had a lot of time to make videos because I've been working on batteries so much lately, um, but I think finally got this one figured out. It, it was a hard one. This one, I came back twice, right? It's my son's, he came back twice, said, hey, I still got it, still got it. Every time I touch the battery, it's hot. Makes sense, temperature sensor's not working correctly. It's warm, uh, shuts down the hybrid sensor our hybrid system and uh and we go from there so finally think i got it <clears throat> i did not disturb the rear ones hopefully those are fine I, I visually inspected them they look fine they're still connected uh readings all look fine after i replace that one so hopefully hopefully that's it anyway update to come if it's not thanks for watching we'll see you next time